the duo of Charlie Oliver and John Buckley. Now, we didn't have Mr. Buckley do a solo. I wonder if it's Mr. Buckley up to doing a solo of his choice. The kind that he played when he's home alone and he's only trying to satisfy himself. Go, 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 they got you. Just play. Amen. That's okay. Amen. Mr. John Buckley. Play one of your tones. Thank you, thank you, John. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, we have we are having a high time in the Lord. And Brother Oliver, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you coming on the show. And uh, I'm going from this day forward uh, with a new appreciation for 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 music in the worship experience uh, because. I have discovered uh, that music is spiritual nourishment for the soul. I mean, spiritual nourishment for the soul. So, for you underneath the sound of my voice and who are listening to me today, uh, the question for this forum is, do you know what part music play in pleasing God. We all know how troubled Saul was in the Old Testament. And it took little David, or David, playing on his heart in order to soothe the troubled spirit of Saul. Music is nourishment for the soul. And there must be a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. Um, I, I'm tempted to ask Brother Oliver to pray, play one of our church songs. Uh, if you want the Lord to bless you, you got to put it in his hand. See, we, we, we're, 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 we're coming down to uh, the last few minutes uh, and if he would play uh, if you want the Lord to bless you, you, you got to put it in his hand. And uh, we, praise, we praise God for that, that he made this provision uh, to worship him in song. Uh, we should have a new or deeper appreciation for the 
worship experience in music. We're ready. for singing that inspirational song. Now I have asked the question, do you know what part music plays in the worship experience? And the part that music plays in the worship experience is dependent upon your relationship to God through his son, Jesus Christ. Now, for the few minutes that I have left, I want to share with you how you can enjoy the worship experience in music. Yes. There are four things that you have to do in order to enjoy the worship experience in music. The first thing you have to do is you have to hear the gospel. Yes. 